Good morning everybody and welcome to day one of my first ever uh, moto vlog. Uh, I'm feeling pretty nervous about everything um, but today I'm going to be travelling over to Cherbourg from Paul. Uh, I spent last night in Paul and met up with uh, Nicola, one of my amazing daughters. And um, so yeah, we've got a bit of a journey ahead of us. So um, this is where I was able to park for the night. We've got everything loaded already. So uh, let's, uh, let's go and get on the ferry. Board? Yes. Okay, name number 11. 11. 11 behind the silver car. It's okay, 11. thank you. That's great. I love the way they shout because they think you can't hear them, which is great. I'm going to use that. That's the great thing about having a bike is they'll they literally put you straight at the front of the queue. I mean, how brilliant is that? Seems almost rude. So there we go, that was four hours, that wasn't too bad, got something to eat, let's see how we get out of here now. Okay, so here we are in France, so yeah I'm feeling really a little bit nervous to be honest, uh, obviously uh, this is something that I've never done before, so um, I'm just going to, I've got a nice hotel booked in for the first night, so I'm going to travel down to there, it's about two and a half hours and uh, I'll just enjoy the journey, gonna try and relax, gotta remember to ride on the right and um, yeah just take my time to get down there. I should arrive around about 5, 5.30 ish and so uh, again I'm just gonna enjoy it, let's see what we can see and then um, settle in tonight and then obviously tomorrow we can start proper. Okay, so we're about half an hour away from our hotel and so I just thought I'd give you a bit of an update really. So why am I even doing this? Well, I've wanted to come away on a bit of a road trip for ages because I've got this nice bike. I'm going to close this down so you can hopefully hear me a bit better. I've got this nice bike and I'm not really using it and it is a big adventure bike. So it makes sense for me to kind of like push it a little bit, but this is well and truly outside of my comfort zone. But I'm really loving it. This is, I mean, I'm obviously in a very fortunate position that I can do this. I'm very fortunate that I can just go away and do this. But if I'm being honest, where I'm at in life age-wise and everything, I'm, I'm actually really happy just going away with the Yana. But this was like this adventure that I kind of had in the back of my mind. So. It's only day one, but I'm loving it so far. <laughs> well, I think we're here. I think actually, I think I've actually just gone past it. Let me just turn around here. I think this is it up on the right here. Yeah, here we go. The Victor Hugo. 
That looks nice. Well, that looks great. So I made it. I'm in a little town called Pontesson, which is about uh, 10 minutes south of um, Mont Saint-Michel. By the way, I'm going to have to apologise. My pronunciation is going to be awful throughout these videos because I don't speak French. I speak a few words of Spanish, but no French. So please forgive me for my awful pronunciation. So um, in case you're not aware, let me just briefly show you where I am. So uh, I am... Uh, there, which is Pontesson, which is about 10 minutes south of um, Mont Saint-Michel. The question I've got to make answer now is, what am I going to do moving forwards? Because the rain is coming in. I'd actually like to go to Mont Saint-Michel, but I don't want to do it in the pouring rain. So I think what I'm going to actually do is sort of make a decision first thing in the morning. If it's pouring with rain or, or, or it's likely later in the day, I'm probably just going to head south and leave that for another time when I can maybe come back and do it with Liana, which is what I really want to do. Um, so if you enjoyed this video, I know it was mainly just an A to B one, but if you did enjoy it, please click on the like button. More importantly, please click on that subscribe button because hopefully I'll be able to show you a few more interesting things over the next few days. So thanks ever so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.